welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. It really means the world to me. So another day home from work on a Saturday and I got my birch box, which makes me very happy because I, you know, I'm having this love hate relationship with birch box lately. And as I open this, I'm going to get into it and tell you what it is in case you don't know. And I'm also going to tell you why I have a love hate relationship with birch box. Birch box used to be a $10 a month subscription. They've recently raised their prices. I'm still paying $10 a month because I was a yearly subscriber. When my subscription is up, to be honest, I don't know what I'm going to be paying. Their new price is going to be $15 for everyone, but there's like tiered pricing. So I guess if you sign up for another year, I think I'll be paying $12 and then there's 15. It is very confusing, but for the moment it's $10, and their reason for raising the prices is they said it was supposed to get much, much better. Now, this time, last month I did not do any sneak peeks, which I don't like to do with my subscription boxes, and I was highly disappointed because it was an entirely hair care related box, and you know, if you know me and my channel, I'm not into that because I usually get dry shampoos and things that I just can't use. So this time I went on, and and I looked at the boxes. They had like five or six curated boxes, and then you could have also chosen to choose one sample. Well, the box that I wanted when I got on to choose was sold out. And the other boxes, I was like, I really don't want any of those boxes. So what I did do instead was I chose my one sample. And I wasn't really thrilled with any of the samples that were my choices, but I did make the choice. And then they said they were going to curate it to basically whatever else uh, was according to my profile. I'm really hoping that they do improve because I don't want to get rid of this box, but we're going to find out. I don't know if this box continues to be not on par with what I want, whether or not it'll cancel, because I usually do get a lot of things for my giveaway. So that is my hope. So I have opened the box and let's see. This is a pretty, well, this is a different box. Normally the boxes have a lift off top. This seems to be in a drawer. Now, what's very, very interesting about this is that the European versions have the pull-out drawer. Are they moving to that more luxurious type of drawer? Because I will absolutely reuse this and put makeup up it. Up it. No, I'm going to put makeup in it and put it on my vanity. So let's see. That's a nice improvement with the little tassel. So this does come all the way out, and of course... <clears throat> On top, it has a card and says, this is not a beauty box. Let us explain. Let me get my glasses and we'll get into this. Okay. Okay, Birch Box. So if you're not a beauty box, what are you? We started Birch Box. We, when we started Birch Box, we set out to make the world of beauty simple. We learned along the way that it's about so much more than that. I'm not going to read this entire thing because it's long. So what they're saying is that they felt there were some people who felt the beauty industry wasn't catering to them. And what they're now saying is that um, your life is so full, you probably don't take the time to prioritize you enough. And they're saying that they want to make you a priority. And it's, they're saying that they want you to take care of yourself. This is a reminder and this is for you. Oh, how cute. There's a little poem on the back. I'll take a snapshot of this and I will put it on um, the screen and you can pause it and read it. It's kind of cute. It's called You, a poem. All right, so I still don't know what it is. I guess it's like a self-care box is what they're saying. So the card on top says, be good to you. Self-care is different for everyone. What's important is finding what matters for you. So anytime you use is well spent. And they're telling you things to do for self-care and on the back they're giving you items. Well, I kind of want it to be, be a beauty box because that's what I signed up for it to be. So let's see. Okay, so here is a $20 coupon for subscribers um, for every friend who joins. So, wow. So essentially, if you guys join under me, I guess I get $20 in loyalty points, which is kind of cool because you can, you can use the loyalty points to get other products. You don't have to sign up if you don't want to. <laughs> okay, so the first thing I'm pulling out is, which I really like, and I think this may have been what I chose. It's the They're Real from Benefit Mascara. I know I didn't need another mascara, but I really do like this one a lot. 
It has a great wand on it. It's got that plastic wand, which I happen to like the feeling of it on my eyelashes. I can, you know, it's not too soft so that you can really feel that it's getting them. So this is really nice and I'm very happy to have that. Ooh, cute. It is a Winky Lux eyeshadow. I love their packaging. This one just has pretty flowers on it. And it, it does open up like this. And this is in the color Frothy. Oh, that's really very, very pretty. I love Winky Lux shadows. I have a lot of their palettes and I want more. I like them because they support animal charities and everything they make practically has kittens on it. That's a, a gorgeous highlighter, perfect for my skin tone. Love it. So far, we're doing really well. The next thing is a moisturizer from Air Repair. It says Com Complexion Boosting Moisturizer. I'm sure I'll get to read up on it. That's a decent sized sample. And I'm always up to trying new moisturizers as long as the ingredients are good. The next thing is from R & Co. and it says Spiritualized Dry Shampoo Mist. Okay, this is interesting. It's, it's liquid. It's not an aerosol can. I don't know. I may try this because it's not your typical dry shampoo. So I may give this a shot. Still got that, you know, one hair care thing in there. They got to stick that hair care thing in there. But that's four items, and it seems like I have a couple of more. And, oh, yes, I did get a Luxie brush. These Luxie brushes are not cheap, but they're very good brushes. And it is an eye packer brush, and I just love these lately. I have a lot, but I've been discovering my favorites, and this is a very, very nice one. It is tapered, so I wouldn't use it for underneath my eyes, but for packing on eyeshadow, especially glitters, I wet them, and they go on beautifully. And it is in their classic pink handle. This is fabulous. And then yay, I got two Wonder Beauty under eye masks. They're baggage claim eye masks. These I absolutely love. They are pricey. I think they're like a $25 for a pack of five, which to me, $5 for one set is very costly. But I think that's the price anyway. But I love these. Okay, Birchbox, you just redeemed yourself on many levels. I absolutely love all my products, and I'm not even angry about this one. We did get, technically I got seven items, because I got two of these, and I love everything I got. Okay, you redeemed for yourself from last week. Now I know what I have to do. I actually like this better, I think, than the curated box that I really wanted. So I'm glad I chose just to choose my sample. So let's read up on this. The Air Repair Complexion Boosting Moisturizer, the full size of it is $23, and it says it's packed with antioxidants and humectants. This rich cream moisturizes and revitalizes dull, dry skin or stressed out skin. I will look up the ingredients, and I'll put yay or nay down here, depending upon what I think about it. The Benefit Cosmetics, their Real Lengthening Mascara in Beyond Black, which I really like black mascaras. The full size is $25, which is expensive, but it's a higher-end mascara. And it says, this formula creates lashes so long and thick you may be mistaken for wearing falsies. No. <laughs> for the full effect, gently wiggle the wand from the lash line to the tips of lashes. Yeah, that's typical with any mas mascara, pretty much. The Luxie Beauty Precision Brush, it is the 239. Do they say that on here? Yeah. But they put like this gold writing on the pink and unless you're like 12... Oh, you have perfect eyesight. I can never read it. But it says it is the Shader Rose Gold Brush. The full size of it is $14, which is pricey for a single brush. Use this brush a slight point at the tip for more control when applying your Winky Lux Latte Kitten Eyeshadow. Oh, that must be from the Latte Kitten Palette. Now I want the Latte Kitten Palette. It's rose gold and pink casing. Adds a chic touch to your makeup bag. The R & Co., Yes, I had lipstick on my teeth. We'll just get past that. And I checked before I started to film. Oh, well. The R Co. Spiritualized Dry Shampoo Mist. The full size of it is $28. And it says this mist uses micellar water technology to dissolve oil and dirt without leaving residue behind. No. Without leaving behind residue. <laughs> Shake bottle and spray eight to six, six to eight inches from hair. You want to wait 30 seconds, then massage in. Problem is, I never have any oils in my hair. Yes, of course, I'm going to have dirt in my hair, so it may be good for that. If it's not drying and doesn't like destroy my hair, I'm going to give it a shot. I just washed my hair last night, so I don't have to use it right now. 
the Wander Beauty Baggage Claim Gold Eye Masks. The full size of it is $25, as I said, and I'm pretty sure you do get five packs of it. It says hydrate, smooth, deep puff, and brighten with this Luxe Eye Mask, which has three layers for maximum absorption of key botanicals and oils. You want to leave them on 10 to 15 minutes, which I love. I can also do my makeup if I choose to do my eyes first. These are so thin and fit so nicely underneath the eyes that you can do that. And they're only 10 to 15 minutes, which is perfect in the morning because your girl doesn't have time to sit around and wait for 30 minutes. So essentially, this is $10 right here. And the Winky Locks Latte Kit and Eyeshadow in Frothy. The full size of the palette is $25, which I think their palettes are definitely worth it. The highly pigmented shimmery champagne shadow feels velvety on skin. It blends onto eyelids with your included Luxie Beauty 239 Precision Shader Blush. So that is it. Of course, I'm going to put the prices down below because I always like to know what the value of each of the things that I'm getting is truly worth. I think this box was spectacular. I think it was t totally worth my sticking around for. They got it right this time. There were a lot of options. If you get Birch Box, please let me know what you chose to do this month. Did you pick one of the curated boxes or did you do what I did and just pick a sample and then see what you got from there? I also wanted to read this because it is Pride Month and they did make a little statement on here. Happy Pride. We're thrilled to partner with Philip Picardi of and Out Magazine this month to celebrate people from all walks of life, especially those in the queer community, who deserve to feel confident, comfortable, and beautiful in their own skin. I completely agree with. And you can go on to birchbox.com slash out to read more. Well, as I said, this was fabulous. I am so, I'm really, really happy. I feel that sense of relief. Again, let me know what you guys got. I'm so curious to know what you think about it and whether you think I should just continue on with this like I've been doing. But thanks for joining me, everybody. I really, really appreciate it. And of course, whatever part of the world you're in on and around, I hope you have an amazing day and amazing week. And I'll talk to you soon in my next one. Bye.